Hi. How's everybody? Hope you're all well. Hello, Penny. Hello, Nani F. Hello, Zavala. Hello, Kyle Hi, Bob. Hello. How are we doing? I don't know what the hell I'm doing today. Server maintenance? Well, I'm not going anywhere. Server maintenance in 15 minutes? I did not prepare for this. Bob, what are your turn up prices? Uh, let's see. They're never good. I'll check you out later. Turn up prices are more important right now. Wouldn't it be great if Flick was here? What is that? <gasps> Did I get KK? Did I get K after just bitching about how KK is never gonna happen. Did I just get KK? <gasps> An actual computer chair. What are your what? Tell me, tell me your prices. See, they're always garbage. They're always garbage over here. What do you mean, nope? What are the chairs there for? This is a cool chair. Yeah, give me the chair. Give me, give me, give me. Give me. A frickin' courtroom podium? Gimme, give gimme, give gimme, give gimme. Take it. Spyro, thanks for all of those bells. One, two, three, four, five. Fifteen hundo, thank you. Oh, I didn't restart the session! Oh, you know what? I'll just leave it. Because you're gonna be the top cheerer anyway. Um, yeah, give me, give me, give me, give me, I don't have a white corner. I don't need that, Shh. no, I don't need any of that. What are you doing in here? You can't shop, I bought everything. Bloop, that's her catchphrase. Fun fact, uh, she came from AJ's town. AJ kicked her out and she ended up just on me. What controller are you using? I'm using a just a regular old pro controller today. <gasps> yes! You have never been here before. Yes! Do you live? Yes! I I I've been waiting for you. Come with me, come! I've got a bow, well, I don't have any now. Oh, sure, take this bug. We'll start off with this. Sell them before the maintenance? Oh, sh is that gonna be a problem? Yeah, give me all the bells. Come on, give me all my money. What's the commission part? Okay, wait, wait, okay. If there's a bug you want me to sculpt... Oh. Oh, like, oh, so he's like a taxidermist, okay. Oh. Why are there chairs? You got me excited for KK. God, I've been hoarding these for you. You better give me so much guap for these guys. Fucking just put something else down, dude. Oh, look at all this money I can put down. Here, fucking plant it. I don't give a shit. Here, put, oh, I don't need, 
Come on, just give me, just give me. KK comes on Saturdays. I mean, if if I have the island ready for KK, that's fine. I don't give a shit if he's here now or if he comes next Tuesday. Take, 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 take. Yes. Yes. It's a great day for both of us, dude. Yes! God damn, dude. Sell! Holy... Good God Almighty. That's- that's the end of the stream, boys. <laughs> What'd you give me? You didn't give me that. I bought that. You have to talk to Isabel to see where your island rating is. Once it hits three stars, KK will come the next day. That's- I'm thi- I mean, the chairs are there. So, I'm gonna talk to Isabel. I gotta do a bunch of shit, though, before the server maintenance happens. Like, I wanna make sure I get all this stuff before anything happens. The chairs don't mean anything, though. Don't... Don't take away my hope. Why are they there? Why are they there? Is someone... Is Flick gonna play for us? We wish to express our gratitude for your continued use of... Yeah, 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 just give me... Oh okay, yeah, I got a bunch of shit. I went a little ham the other day. Rank S! I don't even want any more rooms, though. Alright, it's Isabel time. The animals like to sit in the chairs, that's what they're there for? I've never seen the chairs before, that's what makes me think something changed around here. Isabel, lay it on me, how beautiful is the island now? Let's talk island of owls, baby. Two! <sighs> Did you see how many flowers I put? No, you're a piece of shit, and I hate you. I put so many flowers down. How much more work do I gotta do for you? To do your job and get KK over here. You need more people? I'm- f I have so many people, though. Let me talk to these people. Just- just keep up appearances, you know? Need more furniture outside? Yeah, I'm trying to put more decorative items. I guess we're gonna continue the garden today. She complimented your landscaping. Not good enough! Give me that extra star! Don't be rude to Isabel. I'm allowed to be as rude to Isabel as possible because I hate... ...playing against her in Smash Brothers. I hate it. I hate it. I hate it so much. Give me this weed. You can't even weed your own house. Go on a holiday, their whole economy will crash. Yeah, right? Uh, Peanut. Peanut looks like she's home. Peanut, you making something? You got nothing for me? Go F yourself. Get out of here. Ugh. You guys hear the dog? Just going absolute ape shit right now. <laughs> Alright, what do we got here? Oh, 
Oh, I missed these. Uh, Spyro, thank you for the three months. Uh, Wooshka, thank you for the Twitch Prime sub. Switch Live, thank you for the Prime sub. Uh, and that's it. Thank you, people. And uh, thanks for those bits. Okay. It's been a while since that's happened. Peanut. Weren't you just inside? Oh, I made stairs. I forgot about that. Talk to Nook to sell more plots. For Yo, Spyro! Thanks for the gifts, dude. Rory, you might have offended me. Dude, these people are so needy. Spyro, thank you for gifting a sub to Chad Daddy seven six six, Brat Jr forty two, Sierra O Doherty, Bree Moon, and Noob Check. Thank you. Thank you. Peanut, get out of my way, Peanut. Oh, I also just straight up left weeds down here. Oh, I got four minutes to check out, uh... Those aren't weeds. I got four minutes to check out this place. Let's see what you got, buddy. You should also put fences around your villagers' house, even if it's super close, just around the house. I've been trying. I've been putting some fences. Uh, what do I do? Go here? Oh, no, 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 no. Get out of here. Get out of here. Get out of here. Get out of here. Come on. I got no time here. Come on. Ooh. I like that. I like that. Could also have a a a, a, a streaker coat, a flasher coat. Do I want anything else? Ooh. Oh, hello. That's cute. It's a cute little outfit. Yeah, I'll take the blue ones. I'm a grown man. You ever just think that? You're a grown man. And this is what you're doing? This is what you're doing with your freaking life? Uh, yes. I don't want to wear it, though. No, I don't want to wear it. Thanks! Or there's maintenance. Can we still play without playing online? I think so. Let me just sit with you guys. Hey, can I have some tea? I'm gonna just... I don't want to stop playing, though. I guess it auto-saves. It doesn't matter. Um... I don't have a freaking shovel. I gotta make a shovel. Didn't I just see Flick out that way? By the way, Bob, last night I wrote a super chat of 40 USD just before you and Will went on. After that, I sent it. It. Well, like, it blacked out, but money shows it sent. Se uh, yes. Okay. So that. So me and Will argued about that. Uh, and then I realized after the podcast that. Because he said that you sent 50, which is probably 40. 
it was probably 50 Canadian, 40 USD. I don't know how that works. Um, and then you sent another super chat, but then you referenced the $50 one you did. And then I was confused at the time, but then afterwards I realized that you sent, he will was trying to tell me that you sent one before and our super chats on Streamlabs were broken. So Streamlabs is the thing that we use. It's the thing on the bottom. It's the it freaking this thing, this thing, this thing was freaking broken. So, uh, sorry about that. But I appreciate it. What do I need? It's always freaking hardwood. No, it's never hardwood. It's always regular wood. Bob, your character looks like Overhaul from My Hero Academia. Overhaul? No, he doesn't. Oh, because of the mouth. Because of the mouth thing. Like before he was Overhaul, though, you know? Then he had like the, he had like the little, the little mask. Are there any pictures of him with the with the regular mask? What do I gotta type young overhaul? There he is. It's just a mask. Stream Deck just disconnect. Uh, you suck. Oh, you suck. Are you working out again? What the happened? It just friggin' broke. Am I out of focus? You gotta be like right here. A. Hey. Mouths are hard to draw. <laughs> Bob, is there anything you want to build on your island before you terraform? No, I just want to jump right into the friggin' terraforming. Oh, look at this. I didn't even get to see this with all these flowers. It's so beautiful. Now let's put a freaking Godzilla over here. I bought all these garbage bins, but I don't remember why. <laughs> Well, you gotta turn around. Alright, I want... the Gundam over here. You should go scorpion hunt hunting since you got Flick. <sighs> That's not a bad idea. Is he gonna be here all day? Like if I leave and come back, he'll still be here? Click on him too? Okay, what does he do? Click. Yo, that's fucking sick. Can I customize him? I'm gonna try to customize him. What color should I make him? Get, flick, get out of my... 
area. Can I? Can I? Please? Nope. Can't customize them. Lame. That 30k thing for Twitter, is that for your Bob Twitter? Or you, what are you talking about? I got 30k on my Twitter, so I put a picture of my feet. It's done. It's done. It happened. I pulled the trigger. You can now see my feet. Most of the Nook Mile things have a few colors and each get a random one. Oh, you can't customize it? I'm cool with blue. Trouble Steinberg, thanks for the two months. Thanks for the continuing content, Bob. It's, help, it's helped keep me sane during isolation. And the VOD channel is my go-to time killer work. Thank you very much for supporting all the content, you know? Always talk to Mabel sisters in the store because after a while she Mabel's sister in the store because after all giving yeah, I keep forgetting about that Opinion on the h3 keemstar thing does everybody know about this? I'm sure most of you don't even care Long story short keemstar has always been a huge piece of shit and uh, Everybody's always been saying keemstar is a huge piece of shit and uh for some reason, nobody ever, nothing ever happens to him. He's just allowed to be a huge piece of shit. Um, and H3H, they made another video saying Keemstar is a huge piece of shit. And now, uh, and, and uh, H3H3 is like, why? He's also sponsored by G Fuel. How come G Fuel sponsoring this guy when he's like a racist piece of shit that calls everybody a pedophile? And now people are mad at H3H3 for going after one of Keemstar's sponsors. Cause that's like, it's like a big no-no. It's like no reason to do that. And I kind of agree. It is, he like shouldn't go after the sponsor, but G Fuel's a different story. Cause when I, I kind of associate G Fuel with Keemstar because that's how, you know, that's how much G Fuel sponsors him. Like, I thought he had, like, had a stock in the company or something. He was like, every video had G Fuel on it. He wears a G Fuel hat and it's like part of his personality. And it's a big reason why I turn down G Fuel. Because when I think of G Fuel, I think of him and I don't like him. <laughs> I also think it tastes like trash. But, um... Also... Keemstar does these freaking. Uh, so Keemstar runs the drama alert channel. Uh, and he just does YouTube drama news. But it's like. He kind of he kind of starts drama more than he like reports on it. And he like feeds into it. And it's just really toxic for the whole YouTube community. And it's been toxic for years. In like 2015, there was like this huge boom of drama channels. They were all just going after each other. And H3H3 was kind of part of it. I like H3H3. But there, it, it got like, it got to a point where I was like, all right, you're kind of like just stoking the flames on the whole drama community. Um, and then H3H3 kind of stopped making videos for a while. Oh shoot, I gotta put a, I gotta put bells there, but I got no room. Oh, there we go. I got room now. So... Um... What was I getting at? Where was I in this conversation? Oh. Keemstar. Who runs the drama alert channel. Um, 
he uh he also does these weekly battle royale tournaments that he's been doing for like over a year i think it started with fortnite fridays and they'd have like really big prize pools and they'd have all these huge content creators like compete in a tournament every week um and all these big content creators will like fall over themselves to try to uh, be a part of it cause, for the clout because it's such a big like event because there's all these big creators and they want to be like they want to be able to be like oh, I was in Keemstar's tournament but like why he's such a piece of garbage why would you want to be associated with them with him at all and now he does his Call of Duty tournaments and you know also there was a whole thing another reason why so h3h3 made a video calling keemstar a huge piece of shit and part of that video he talks about the whole etika situation etika was a big uh uh like nintendo youtuber he was kind of you know uh i don't want to say edgy but he was kind of edgy um and he it, he committed suicide like what like two years ago i think or over a year ago um he had like a huge mental breakdown and keemstar kind of uh broadcasted his huge mental breakdown and like fed into it and interviewed him and stuff it was really fucked up um and so that happened and then keemstar was like uh trying not to take the blame for it and i mean there's a lot of factors why he did what he did but uh i mean keemstar definitely didn't help and then after that happened keemstar wanted to do since he was doing these battle royale tournaments he wanted to do a tournament with smash brothers in you know and like raise money for some charity because of etika it was all like around etika and the smash brothers community was like Nah, you can go fuck yourself, Keemstar. We don't want to be associated with you because you're a huge piece of shit. And then shut that down completely. So I don't understand why Fort the Fortnite and uh, Call of Duty communities can't do the same thing and be like, hey, I, I mean, it's cool that you want to start a tournament, but nobody wants to be associated with you because you're a huge piece of shit. Oh, and I left out the fact that G Fuel dropped. Uh, did I leave out the fact that G Fuel dropped? Keemstar. I'm like half talking like you guys know the story and half talking like you don't know the story. <laughs> so if there's anything I left out, uh, I mean, because I'm sure some of you people watching have no idea any of these people or anything that I'm talking about. Um, but yeah, after Ethan made the vi or H3H3 after he made the video, Saying Keemstar is a huge piece of shit, and then saying why does G Fuel sponsor this guy? G Fuel dropped Keemstar, um, and that's why everybody's like he shouldn't have gone after his sponsors. You know, it's kind of fucked up. Now, when there's YouTube drama, everybody's gonna go directly after the YouTuber sponsors. But it's I think it's different with G Fuel because again, I associate the G Fuel brand with Keemstar because of how close they were. So. I feel like it's it's a different and they shouldn't have sponsored him anyway. He's a piece of shit. Like literally Keemstar's telling people to kill themselves. And there's a fucking G Fuel cup next to him. He's got a G Fuel hat on. You know what I mean? <laughs> Bob, now you're going to be on drama alert. I don't f I don't fucking care. I don't I don't feed into that shit, you know? I don't... I stay away from that shit. I never knew any of this stuff about Keemstar. Do you watch Keemstar? Do you know... I feel like if you know who Keemstar is, you know he's a piece of garbage. How, like, how could you not? What was Rue doing with the fridge? He was lick. If you look at my Instagram story, he was licking under the fridge for whatever. He just does that. He just licks the the corners of the of the kitchen. So by proxy, G Fuel is telling people to kill themselves. I don't know about that. 
But no, again, like I uh, part of the reason why I don't like G Fuel is because I think that some of the people they sponsor are like questionable and I don't want to be associated with that whole situation. That's why I'm like, it's kind of understandable why you would go after G Fuel, you know, but uh, my biggest criticism of H3H3's video is that if you're going to go after G Fuel, you should go after the Call of Duty and uh, Fortnite tournaments that he does and go after the people who just openly support that, pretending like Keemstar is not a huge piece of shit. The reason he didn't do that was probably because there's these gigantic creators associated with it, like um, Dr. Disrespect, Ninja, uh, you know, Nade Shot. I don't know who else. Basically the biggest Fortnite and Call of Duty streamers. They're all associated with Keemstar's tournaments. And it's you can't go up against that clout wise but i mean hey if you're gonna go after g fuel they're just as guilty and that's why i'm so goddamn proud of the fucking smash brothers community for being like nah dude we're good we want nothing to do with your ass you hear another in-game balloon impossible i don't even know how to look I probably missed it. Where's my friggin... Oh, I see it. Oh my god, you're so far. I used to watch Fortnite Friday and never watched him again because... You bitch. Because he is a cloud chaser. I didn't know about the etiquette thing. Oh yeah, you can- I think you could still see his interview with Etika when he was having the fucking mental breakdown. You shouldn't watch it, it's horrible. Oh! I actually have one of these floor lights and I wanted to use it. I was gonna get it out, but I freaking got it right here, baby. Pink? I mean, alright, fine, whatever. Can I move it? You can't move it? I wanna put it right in front. It's not gonna work, is it? God, can I put it under him? That would be sick. Ah, oh, you suck. I got no room. All right, let me talk to Blathers. Same with the Minecraft community. Uh, major 1995 and a bunch of the other people who did his Minecraft Mondays made their own tournament and now pretty much all of them said fuck you Keemstar and play <laughs> That one's instead. That's awesome. I mean, I Minecraft is pretty like, you know, they're probably all like uh, Safe for work like kids stuff so I could understand why they would want to be like hey, man uh, We don't want anything to fucking do with you. Even the big ones like, wait, where am I? Even the big ones like Sparkles and Dan TDM do Scots now instead of Keems. Does Keemstar still do Minecraft tournaments? I had no idea. Put it on the floor and then put Godzilla on top. That's what I'm gonna do, but uh, I have no room, so I gotta do this first. Do the museum stamp event? I heard it's stupid. I don't like Keemstar either. Boogie, uh, or whatever his name is, said on Twitter how Keemstar was nice to him, but then Keemstar quickly turned on Boogie when he realized his words didn't help Boogie out after saying something like, just don't be sad. Yeah, uh, H3 talks about that in his second video about Keemstar. Another huge thing that H3 was saying about Keemstar is that he doesn't understand, uh, Mental illness. He doesn't believe in some of it. <laughs> like it's a like it's fucking Santa Claus. And um, he like uses it against people. Like he calls people weak if they have any sort of mental illness. And Boogie apparently was was talking about how he had something. Ah, oh, damn it. 
And anyway, Keemstar tried to talk to him and like, you know, help him out and then just quickly just started yelling at him. <laughs> About how he's weak. I can't put the floor light here, that's so annoying. Good, good enough spot as any. Wait, maybe, maybe. Put it here. Nope. Come on, come on. Be, be it. Can you, can you go and like? Oh, okay. All right, that's good enough. That's good enough. Bruh, in the Keemstar Etika vid, in the first two minutes, he is hyping up Etika being depressed as fuck. Uh, you mean like making him more depressed? Or you mean like, yeah, he, I mean, that's how drama alert videos are. He like gets really excited about the horrible things that are happening to other people. You can see his, he's like bloodthirsty. It's fucked up. Keemstar sounds like Alex Jones from InfoWars. Actually, I was looking at Reddit and a lot of people were saying he's the Alex Jones of YouTube. And then other people were saying, well, that Alex Jones is the Alex Jones of YouTube. <sighs> this exhausts me, this conversation. Do you have a penis lake? Do I? Uh, fl I almost called him Lick. Flick, you are in my way, dude. Do I have a penis lake? Is that a penis? That's not a penis. What type of penis is that? It's a sad ass penis. Up? You mean up this way? Oh, let me get these. Look, I sold property already. I just gotta wait for that. Why am I waiting for that to build? That should have been built already. I think I just need one more dude to get the three stars. Look at your map, oh, okay. That's a penis. That's a penis. North, uh, west, that's a... Uh... It's like almost a dog bone, but almost definitely a penis. Let's go look at the penis. Okay, let's get stuck first. So much drums. I've been following the call her daddy thing too. I was surprised to see that on Philip DeFranco. I actually watched that on Philip DeFranco. So that's another, that's a weird thing. I don't know much. I've never heard of those people before. So call, what is it? Call, call her daddy. Th that's like a, that's a podcast. These two girls. I, I don't know anything about them. Here's my penis. Everybody look at my, oh wait, that's not it. Oh, it is it. Oh, it's got a kink in it. My penis like has a kink in it. Oh wait, don't I have a, don't I have a staircase here? Yeah, buddy. Oh, it's so quick to get up. Here's my, here's my, Penis waterfall. I'm gonna have to blur that out. Anyway, Call Her Daddy was like a podcast and then it got bought by Barstool. I don't know much about the whole situation. I just saw it on Philip DeFranco. Uh, and then they had like some weird contract disputes and then they like were like trying to renegotiate and then they weren't uploading content and like while they were renegotiating and then the there was so much like renegotiations that the guy the barstool guy who's another one <laughs> he's a fucking another one um portnoy uh 
he uploaded a 30 minute just him explaining his side of the situation to their podcast feed. Isn't that? That's fucked. <laughs> Regardless of how the negotiations are going, that's kind of fucked up to do that. That'd be like if our management company just... That'd be, that'd be like if we just stopped uploading on YouTube and our management company uploaded to our YouTube channel. That I would be fucking furious if that happened. They're screwing him over. I mean... Then sue, then sue them. You know? They're screwing... So this podcast... These podcasters are screwing Portnoy over and his company. Because they're not uploading content. Because he bought them and then they just stopped uploading content. Well, then you just made a fucking bad business decision. You gotta eat that money. You know? That's, I mean, that's just how that is. You, uh, they're, 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 I mean, they're, they're not innocent either. They want, like, an insane amount of money for their, their podcast. I think, I think there's a lot of, I think there's just a lot. Sometimes, everybody's wrong in, in a situation. Bye, I think you missed a fossil on the trees. Left to the penis lake. Okay, we'll go left of my penis. Their podcast kind of sucked anyways. <laughs> They were just trying to copy guys we fucked, oh god, and failing because they weren't nearly as funny as the guys we fucked gals. Who- Did they have- did these people have anything before that? The guys we fucked people were like influencers already, weren't they? Were these people also influencers? Did you say left of the penis leg? Left, okay. Keemstar starts making fun of Etika for going to the mental hospital. Oh, are you watching the friggin' interview? That interview shouldn't be up anymore. Is it on drama alert? Or is it- did somebody re-upload it? You shouldn't be able to watch that shit, that's fucked up. God damn it. I gotta... empty my damn pockets. Oh, there's another one. Oh, I don't have any room. God damn it. I gotta empty my pockets. I got too much shit in my pockets. Take me home. So empty your pockets. All right, I will. Norm circle, I will. Jesus Christ, man. Let me go here first. Do you remember Alex C and D? Whatever happened to him, he's just doing his own thing. I met him one time. And uh he had no idea. I knew who he was, he had no idea who I was. Oh wait, I want to sell more. Drop money bags in the house? No, I must protect my money. You never know when Dave Portnoy might <laughs> come and try to steal it. <laughs> Bob, would you do a stream with Boogie one day? Sure, I like him. He's great. I don't think he would want to do a stream with me, but he is great. Put it in the bank, you'll collect interest on it. I don't trust the raccoon man. I might put it under my mattress. Can I get a safe? Like in the game?
Why do people play Animal Crossing, bro? Uh, for the Xbox Live points. For the achievements. That's why. Fire Lion, thank you for the Twitch sub. I just realized your name's PlayStation Loser. <laughs> and I made an Xbox joke. I want to keep the. I want to. Yeah, this goes away. Uh, didn't I want this for something? Oh yeah, I wanted to put it here, but then I can't sit. Oh wait, maybe I can. No, 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 no. Nah, yeah, you can't sit. Damn it. But Sam was taking the dog. Hold on a second. I just wanted to open my door so the dog could come in. I gotta fix this scene. I'm sideways! Shit, dude. Shit, dude. I'll just leave it sideways, who cares? <laughs> I do want to actually fix this one, so I'm not sideways. Uh, transform. Uh, clockwise? Ah, I did the wrong thing. Fuck. Which one did I do? Ah. Don't mind me. Don't mind me. Don't mind me. I'm out of focus. Get me in focus. Am I in focus now? Yeah, it's better. Found you on YouTube a week ago, and I have been addicted to your review videos. Thought I would come say hey and show some love. Thank you very much, Violine. I appreciate it. Bob, how's your espresso life going? It is good. I've been having some great espressos. I am trash at uh, frothing the milk, though. No, no I, I take that back. I'm trash at latte art. I thought this was getting close to something good. And then uh, I looked at it now, and I'm like, that doesn't look like anything. <laughs> look at, look at that. That's supposed to be, that's supposed to be like a leaf. <laughs> it's an onion. Yeah, that's what it is. It looks like a galaxy. They all look like galaxies. I was watching videos on your personal channel because I wanted to keep up the good work. Thanks, dude. I uh, was supposed to be editing one today. And I didn't. And that's my story. Can I customize a garbage can? Well, actually, no, I can't. That's dumb. Would you play COD Mobile? 
Sure. I mean, I have friggin' Warzone, so I'd much rather play that. Uh, uh I want to put garbage cans like here. This is a good. Ah, uh, it's not a good spot. Where? Where is? It? Who did what? Oh, Jay Madsen. Thanks for the YouTube being a member on YouTube. Bob, who is James and why do you have a picture of his butt on your phone? James is our, James does like our, I guess I'll call him the convention cinematographer. But he's also one of my best friends. Where do I want to put this? Oh, you know what? I'll put it around back. Put it around like on the side over here. I should put boxes over here too. You need a garbage bin. It's a little details that matter, you know? Who else needs a garbage bin? I already got one. I would like a recycling bin. Bob, how many games you think we getting for Nintendo's 30th? Sunshine 64, I think definitely 64. Um, Sunshine, I'm a little, uh, Sunshine, I'm like 65% on, like I think we'll, we'll get it, but if any of them are not going to happen, I think that's the first one to get cut. And I think Galaxy 1 and 2 for sure, we'll get. Get a oyster, thank you, for the Twitch Prime sub. Also, I never explained why I have a picture of James's butt on my phone. So when we were at PAX, I was with the guy with the hair people, formerly known as uh, Blockhead Gaming. Uh, ooh, hello. And we all filmed a bunch of stuff. And we were like sharing footage. So one of the days when I was dumping footage to them, uh, I just took a picture of James's bare ass and put it in the, like, just put it in the files. <laughs> so when they're going through all the all the footage, they just see James's bare ass. <laughs> I made my Nook's cranny look like a gas station. That's actually a really good idea. Man, I missed all the good shit at PAX. You missed, you calling James's bare ass good shit? I have this great video from PAX that I want to put on my personal channel, but it might, uh, ooh. But it's gonna take a while. Uh, it's, I made James try out this VR game that's supposed to make you feel like you're on mushrooms. And we had to go to it wasn't on the show floor. It was at a ho it was in a hotel room. We had to go meet this guy in his hotel room. It was super weird. It was such a weird experience, but it's such a funny video. Or at least the footage is funny. I haven't even edited it yet. Um What happened was funny, but <laughs> uh I gotta wait for this to go all the way over there now. That's so dumb. Thoughts on Plain Rock 124? Explain that. I have no idea what that is. Come on. Oh, I forgot about the office chair. Cypress plant. Oh. 
That's cool. I like that. Where do I want to put that? That's a that's a in the home thing. Can I put it in the corner over here? Something's going on outside. Yo, Des Cole, thank you for the Twitch Prime sub. Could you shut the fuck up out there? This isn't gonna go here. That actually looks kind of nice. Yeah. Yeah, I like it. It's staying. I don't think this should. It's like right in the middle of everything. Uh, what else do I have in here? Oh, the office chair. You know, I did have the same walls in my Animal Crossing. It's the best looking walls, dude. Give me this. Put the black one down. Why would I want it to face this way? What up, Decept John? If you could have one GTA game remastered, which one would you pick? I think GTA 4 or GTA San Andreas would be cool. I am not really, I just don't, I don't really, I don't think that's necessary. I don't really want any of them remastered. I only ever, I mean, well, if they remaster the third one, I would play it. <laughs> I just... I... I only beat the second one. And five. I played a little bit of San Andreas, but... That's it. Yeah, I don't want to put flowers down yet. I guess I could put some here. No, I don't want to do it until I know how big the road's gonna be. Yeah, so I guess I'm done with this. I can say hi to some people. Would you do a video on games you think should be on Switch and why? Uh, have I not done that? Maybe? I think my next video is good. What is this? Are you into comics? Oh, okay. And AJ threw this person off of his island. It's my favorite type of comic. Fantasy, those are bad options. Fantasy, no. Superhero. Is that one word? Yes. Do you have do you have anything important to say? <laughs> uh oh. 
black tea. Nello, thank you for the two months. Wait, what's, what's happening? Nothing. I was just holding down R too long. Chai, get out of here. Black tea, baby. I got a notification for a new Wolf Den Clips video. Grandpa learns what a simp is. All right. Well, we'll see how that goes. <laughs> Technically, chai is black tea, just spiced. Yeah, it's like... I mean, when I think chai tea, I think of the latte, which is like not even a, a coffee drink. You have a frickin' bathtub in the middle of your room? What is happening, dude? Welcome back. Welcome, welcome back for another episode of Klaus Show. I don't like you. Golden Gears. Okay, whatever. Oh, I have another fossil. I guess I should put fences around these guys. Oh, that's dumb. What is that? Make him a shirt that has the same color as his skin, so he looks like he's just wearing a red toga. Oh my god. What, what do I got here? Stone fence. Simple wood fence. Iron and stone fence. What? Oh, I have one piece of this. What is Klaus? What is... What type of fence do you think that man needs. Brick fence, let's just box him in. None of these really say Klaus to me. This is Bertha. You can get a stone fence. You can super get a stone fence. Guys, like no room. Bob, do you think you'll ever go to visit Subscriber Islands? M maybe. I mean, it's usually random when I do shit like that. Uh, it just takes so freaking long, dude. Oh, you know what I wanted to do today? I wanted to do media share. I forgot to do that. That's like where you people can donate money and like a video will play. I want to do, no, I want that like that. I want to do media share where instead of money, it's channel points, but that's not a thing apparently. Apparently I made that up. Give him a little bit of a backyard. This freaking tree. Oh. Let me eat this. Don't. Ah, I always drop. I always drop. Where are you? 
Oh, I got it already. Eat. My friend randomly told me that if you flick your nipple, that it will get hard within set. Well, that's a thing. That's a real thing. Did you do it? So, Bob, how do you feel knowing Jerry's fetish is watching your videos? Uh, it's definitely not. He definitely doesn't watch my videos. Or at least, often. What do you want? I don't even know who you are. Heard all about what you're up to. What am I up to? How are you going to make Butt Island so famous that- Yes! You know what? I'm going to help you chase this crazy dream. I've got it. What if we, like, make a powerful spot somewhere on the island? What does that mean? Just a big, powerful center of good vibes. That's gonna- that's the opening with the fountain. Whatever you give me, I'm putting it in front of your house. Unless this thing is, like, fucking awesome. That's a good spot. Yo, I can't even fucking see it. <laughs> Peanut, I admire your your effort and your help, but gotta say, I want nothing to fucking do with this thing. You know what, I'll put it down here by the beach stuff. have a wild wild rock that's filled with flam what with flamingos because it looks like they're a flock yet somehow on five stars that's because it just counts as a decorative item you can just fucking put anything anywhere there you go that's not ain't that nice you know what you can get a freaking garbage can There you go, I have a garbage can. We'll also put a peach tree. Okay, maybe not. Maybe you can go fog yourself. I hate how American TV always have British characters with a posh accent, like where's the West Midlands, Welsh and others. Americans always think that a British accent is really attractive. Like when you see somebody and then they have like a British accent, you're like, oh, that like makes it exotic, or it gives them, like, a little extra to, like, you know, their attractiveness. But I saw somebody the other day on Twitch, and she was already pretty attractive, and then I clicked through, and I saw, and then she was talking, and I was like, that's a, ew, <laughs> that accent. 
It was like some like Welsh or something. It was like it was it was not the type of you know attractive British. <laughs> there was some list online of attractive accents or least attractive accents and Long Island was marked the least attractive accent. <laughs> Was it Plumbella? I don't know who it was. And I and I will I would not name who it was if I knew who it was. It was some Call of Duty streamer. Oh, what am I doing right now? I gotta plant a tree. Ooh. Gimme. I'm fucking rich. I go into a slight southern accent unintentionally. I don't know why some things I say sound southern. Are you, you're not from the south. So Bob, any hair care tips for men with long hair? I've been growing mine out for two years now. I was gonna make like a tweet or something, like hair care tips for people who just have long hair now because of the quarantine. Uh, I don't think I'm qualified, you know? The only tip that I think is most important is don't wash your hair every day. You gotta give it time to breathe. You should wash your hair less than you would think. Like, at most, I mean, everybody's hair is different, but at most you should wash it every other day. Um, I've been told dry shampoo is a good alternative. Yes, but you also don't need to use that. Do you hear this guy yelling? This guy just yells. It's like the resident homeless guy. He just walks around the block and yells. Um, a lot of people, uh, I a lot of people will say I have to wash my hair every day because I get dandruff. Yeah, well, I used to get really bad dandruff, and I would wash my hair every day with Head and Shoulders, which is a dandruff shampoo. And then I heard you're not supposed to wash your hair every day, so I stopped washing my hair every day, and I stopped getting dandruff. So Head and Shoulders does absolute jack shit. If anything, it gives you more dandruff. I love the fact that haircutting places are closed so my family doesn't complain about my hair being long because I'm a boy. <laughs> you just gotta rock it and then your family will shut up. So you wash every second day? Yeah. Um, but I like doing things don't copy me. You gotta do what works for you, you know? Uh, but I, I wash my hair on Mondays, Wednesdays, and Saturdays. And I don't condition it, which I probably should. But when I condition my hair, it makes my hair feel extra greasy because I guess my hair is already naturally like oily. Um, so I just haven't conditioned my hair in forever. And I used... Uh, I don't want to say what I use because <laughs> I might be getting a sponsorship. I use one of the men's shampoos that has the, hold on, let me know what it, let me, the hair regrowth shit because I'm losing my hair. Um, DHT blocker shampoo, one of the subscription services that has the DHT blocker shampoo. That's the only shampoo I use every other day. You don't put it on your scalp. Yeah, you're talking about conditioner, right? I know, but it still makes my hair feel greasy. It makes my hair feel, it makes my hair feel gross to me, so I stopped using uh, 
uh, conditioner. I would like uh, like a leave-in conditioner so I could put it on like when I'm not like going anywhere. I remember one time I was in Target with our good buddy Jerry, and I bought dry shampoo. And uh, he was like, "Ew, you dirty man! Why are you buying dry shampoo?" And we were with there with a bunch of people, and everybody was there with their girlfriends. And I was like, everybody uses dry shampoo. He's like, no, they don't. That's gross. Take a shower. And I was like, first of all, when was the last time you showered, Jerry? <laughs> Second of all, hey, Jerry's wife, do you use dry shampoo? She's like, yeah, all the time. And I was like, hey, so-and-so's wife, do you use dry shampoo? Yeah, I use it all the time. Okay. Got anything else to say, Jerry? I only really use dry shampoo if I didn't wash my hair that day and I'm going somewhere. I don't know what to do anymore in this fucking game. I guess should I go make a spider island? Or a scorpion island? Since I got flick, maybe get some bones? Why isn't... Why didn't anybody move in? Oh, someone is moving in. Okay, then. Only women use dry shampoo? Okay, I guess I'm a woman, then. <laughs> I guess I'm a fucking woman, then. You should go villager hunting. It's a rage. A lot of people are doing that. That's like a thing. Let's sell this tiger beetle, you know? Flick, I'm trying to get to you here. It took me a while to build up the confidence to stop wearing my, uh... Poke and rocking my hair felt really good yesterday when people were complimenting my hair. What is that? Took me a while to start putting my hair in a man bun. Oh, it's a hat. Is it one of these? Is it? <laughs> Well, that's a lot of money for that little beetle. Uh, I want to move this somewhere. What will make this look most city-like? By the bridge? Like over here, maybe? Yeah, no one's going to be walking over here. All right, I guess we're gonna make a spider island. Unless I, uh, I don't want to put fences over here because I want to move these things. You don't get a fence because you're weird. Lizdrin, thank you for the twenty. Seven months, not actually here, just doing what I do every month. Well, that's fine, dude. Thanks for dropping by. And dropping one of them, guys. Alright, I gotta... Did I give these guys fences? I gotta make some brick fences. In fact... This should be a brick fence. Yeah, this should be a brick fence. I'm taking your fence. I'm taking your damn fence. You don't get a fence anymore. You're not even... You don't even live here. What are you doing? Hello, Skycast. The only use... I only use beanies in the cold seasons. Yeah, that's... <laughs> I, I don't... Well, I mean, in Canada, it's probably cold all the time. It is weird to have a beanie on 
all year round. Uh, this can be stone. This would look cool. Do you guys hear this homeless man? Motherfucker! That's all he does. He just walks around the block. Motherfucker! I'll be walking the dog. He just walks past. God damn, motherfucker! White people! Can't hear him. Maybe only I can hear him. Maybe he's the mystical bum. Why? Why did you go over there? Scream OG. Thank you for the uh, sub for extending your sub. And J Buggy, thank you for gifting a sub to Zinny. I appreciate it. I'm gonna make a little alleyway here. Why? Why? I guess I could I could put it outside your home. I could make you an oddly shaped fence. Yeah, you know what? I want, I want to see if I can make an oddly shaped fence here for you. Or I can just do this. Any upgrades regarding your mom and her Switch? Any updates? Uh, no. She she definitely gave up on playing it. <laughs> Which is unfortunate, because I want to make a video on it. I think I can get her to keep playing it, though. Why not Terraform? Because fucking KK isn't here! Let's go over more. Okay, that works. Give you a, a bigger opening here. I'd say that's good enough. Tells you pretty much what you need to do to get three stars. I know what I need to do. I'm fucking. What do you think I'm doing? What do you What do you think? I'm just putting a fence for this guy because I think he'd like the fence. Plant some bushes. I could plant a bush. Here you go. Have a bush. Actually, uh, I have the bush fence. Bob, she told you that you need to increase the population. I have a person coming! And I think that's the last person I need. Go to guest services and get more fencing styles. Leave me alone. I'm gonna I'm sh sh shut shut your faces. I'm gonna fucking 
I'm, I wanted to, I want that to be a brick fence. I'm gonna make a brick fence. Okay, this is my my game. I'm gonna do it how I want to do it. Okay. What do I need for a brick fence? Clay. I need a lot of clay. Got plenty of clay over here. Guest services. What is this target? Will used to work guest services at Target. Hello, the Sin family. Bob, we just want to see you succeed. No need to rage. Uh, you'd fucking know that that's how it'd be. Okay. 10? No, we need more than that. I worked at Target, worst fucking job. I actually didn't hate it. So I worked at Target as a cashier like everybody. Then I started working in electronics and I was like, this is dope. I want to work in electronics all the time. This is cool. I can talk about video games, people. And I told my manager that and he's like, yeah, we'll put you in electronics all the time. And then that lasted two weeks and then I was a card attendant for like two years. <laughs> they shoved me outside. Um, then it got to the point where they used to, uh, like the they like lost the maintenance guy or something. So then they thought that maintenance was part of my job as a card attendant. So they made me clean the bathrooms. But only when it was like, somebody blew up the bathroom did I have to clean it up so the first time that happened there was just somebody fucking just shit all over the bathroom and the manager was like Bob you gotta go clean the bathroom and I was like why and he's like somebody clogged up the toilet and there's shit everywhere and I was like Where, where's the maintenance guy and they're like he's not here so you gotta do it and I was like I'll do it but you're coming with me and I made the manager come with me to help me clean it up <laughs> He's like, well, somebody's got to do it. And I was like, all right, then I guess we're doing it. And then we both went and did it. And I was like freaking 17 when I when I did this. <laughs> um, then the second time it happened, I did it with uh, another cart attendant. We both had to like, the, the toilets like overflowed and we both had to mop it up. The third time I was with another cart attendant and uh, somebody blew up the toilet and then the manager's like, hey, Bobby, you gotta go clean the bathroom. And I was like, all right, I'm sick of doing this. I'm not doing it. You need to get a mate. You need to hire a new maintenance guy. It's ridiculous that I have to do this job also. And they're like, no, it's part of your, it's part of your job to do that. And I said, show me in the job description where it's part of our job to clean the bathroom. And then the manager just got on her walkie talkie to write me up and like walked away. And the card attendant that I was with was a new, was like a, I guess a newer guy. He was like, dude, what the fuck, man? <laughs> he was like freaking out that I was like going to get us in trouble. I was like, just calm down. Nothing's going to happen. And nothing happened because where in the job descriptions to say that I have to clean up shit. Nowhere. It's not my job. It's somebody else's job that they just neglected to hire and they thought this guy pushes carts outside Let's push him around And then I quit because I was like fuck this uh, But I put in like a two weeks I like quit very like amicably But part of my <laughs> part of all I, I went to like there's like an employee desk like in the back room And I just asked for like the resignation like paperwork and I just signed the resignation paperwork um, and part of it was like, uh, <laughs> part of it was like, why are you leaving? And I said, in hopes that my, uh, aspirations stretch farther than the target parking lot. <laughs> and the, like, like, like the head manager guy, like pulled me aside one day and was like, Hey, I heard you leaving. Uh, is 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 every is everything okay? Like it, 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 I, I read your thing. Is is like is are we good? And I was like everything's fine. I just uh, don't want to do this job anymore. And he's like okay, all right, good luck. And that was that.
that was the same guy who told me I would, I would start working in electronics and then he uh, put me on the carts. I actually liked being a cart attendant until they started making me clean up shit. Because I just pushed cart carts around, I would listen to music. Um, and they would give me free Starbucks when it was cold, too cold or too hot. But I quit that job without having another job lined up. But it was also like, like of course I... Well, you know, I, I'm not cleaning up shit. It's not my job. Um... Well, I quit that job. And then... I got a job... I don't remember if this was bef If this was right after Target. But I got a job... Where I was making planograms it was a third-party company that was making planograms for home depot so if you ever worked in retail you know when you set up like a like a store like an aisle or like a shelf there's like a there's like a a map that tells you where to put all the items and it's different for every store uh i did that for over like a summer for the door aisle the Masonite door aisle in Home Depot. And they made us do it in Excel. Which is horrible. Um, and then I did that for fucking basically every Home Depot store. And then that job was done and then they laid me off. Because there's nothing else to do. And they lost the contract for it because they fucking did everything in Excel and it took forever. Uh, and then I think I started working for Ralph's Italian Ices, which was the worst job I've ever had. Everybody was... It was all, it was all fucking, like... Teenage girls. My girlfriend at the time got me the job. And it was all... It was teenage girls and jocks, and they all fucking... Did not like me. <laughs> And I only lasted a few weeks, and then I had to, and then I, uh, went on tour for like two weeks with my band, and then I just never came back to that job. It was a weird thing, you had to like, every week you had to put in your availability. So, I just never came back to the job. Um... And then I was fucking broke, because again, I didn't have a job. <laughs> uh, and then what happened? Oh, and then GameStop. Then I worked at GameStop for like a long time. <sighs> wow, everybody's in the circle. Or square. Everybody's here. Everybody's in this shape. I don't know shapes. I worked at GameStop for a long time. And then I worked at... Uh, some other bullshit graphic design job. Um, and then I worked at uh, Busted Tees and TeePublic.com doing graphic design. And now I'm here. Hello. How are you? This is my job. You mean a rectangle? It's a polygon. Okay. Buddy. I know what polygons are now. The cafe team at the Target started an oven fire that I had to put out because no one knew how to use an extinguisher. After that, I did parking lot demonstrations where I lit a small fire in an isolated area and showed the team how to use it. Did they... Was that sanctioned? Because a fire department should do that. <laughs> Not you. My current job is all teenagers. I'm a barista, but our store is inside a mall. 
So all our customers are snotty teenagers. Most of my coworkers are snooty teenagers. I feel like a dinosaur, oh my God. It sounds like the worst. The first GameStop that I worked at was in a mall. And one of the employees that worked there also worked at the Starbucks that was right outside of the uh, GameStop. So we got fucking free Starbucks all the time. It was awesome. And that was when I drank like the expensive lattes. I mean, macchiatos, whatever they call them. I'm like putting off making this like a uh, friggin' island. I don't know why. I gotta put my stuff away. You're gonna all gonna be very happy. I have to put my bells away for a minute. Oh wait, no, I wanted to put the brick up. Oh, this is ADD the game, dude. Can't focus for shit. I also did a bunch of freelance work in between all of those jobs that I left out. Because it's kind of irrelevant. At least you ain't wasting lives in this game. <laughs> I don't like the little tea that it makes. I wanted to apply to a tech store and they said no. <laughs> Why? Hey. I gave Cherry here like a lot of property. And freaking Roses, she was my favorite Islander for a while. And then I got Peanut. And I said, fuck you, Cherry. I think this has to go there. Yeah, this has to go here. Really wish this game would let you lock the fences and items so you don't accidentally pick stuff up. Yeah, that'd be nice. It's a big uh, entryway. Yeah, look at all this freaking. No, this is my property. I should fence off. I should redo all of the, all the fruit trees. I should. Ooh. I should take all these fruit trees and put them somewhere else. Peanut's my birthday buddy, oh my god. Bamboo noodle slide. Let's see what that looks like. What? Okay. <laughs> All right. Um. All right. How much more brick do I have? Three. That's not enough for anything. All right, that's it for the fences. All right, Flick, I'm gonna get a couple of uh, spiders for you. Or whatever they're called. Uh, drop, drop, drop. Uh, put in storage. Put 
put in storage, put in, no, don't grab. Why? Why did that happen? Why? Why did it just take one? I'll put this shit in storage. Uh, I don't need this right now. I don't need all these rocks. Fossils I'll put away. I'll keep the tree branch. I'll keep that. Oh, I don't need these tree branches. Actually, I don't need any tree branches. Put them all away. I don't need any rocks either. Put everything away. Put it all away. I'm gonna get so many resources. I'm not gonna try to fill my inventory with, with, uh, with shit. I can't put it away. That's annoying. That is annoying. Now. Okay. You don't deposit money? No, I don't want the big nook man to take my money. Build another plot of land before you leave. But I already have someone coming. But you get interest. That's just, that's, that's just the capitalist mindset, man. You know? Oh, I can't make a donation. You have to fucking evaluate it first. I'm so sorry. Build not a plot of land, you don't have 10 residents yet. <laughs> Can you even do that? If I can't do that, I'm gonna reach through the internet and choke you like fucking your Bart Simpson. It's part of Pac-Man's 40th birthday celebration, it's Bandai Namco and Amazon just announced Pac-Man Live Studio, a new game that lets you play multiplayer and upload custom maps. Wow. Did you just copy and paste that from somewhere? Yes. You copied and pasted that from Kotaku. <laughs> As part of Pac-Man's 40th birthday celebrations, Bandai Namco and Amazon uh, are just announced Pac-Man Live Studio, a new game that lets you play multiplayer and upload custom maps. Wow. Neato. Interestingly, you don't need to download a thing. The entire project will live on a Twitch page, which not only gives you an instant way to upload and share creations and runs, but also provides a community of people to vote on maps and prove hot. Oh, that's fucking weird. And, you know, draw dicks. <laughs> All right. So Pac-Man maker. You buy the plot of land, then get Nook Mile tickets to get island to go on island tours to look for villages you want. I just want anybody. I don't. I'm not picky, man. Did I assess the fossils yet? I just want villagers as quick as possible, so I don't I'm not I whoever comes comes, you know. I'm gonna put this shit down here. 
Oh. I want to just drop it. So I have a rose. What am I going to do with one rose? What are you doing? Help me out here. I'm thinking of maybe, you know, moving. Oh, no! No! You're my favorite one. What the fuck? Okay. What the fuck is wrong with you, Peanut? Why are you gonna scare me like that? Oh, I wanted to give her a rose. God damn it. Yeah, I'm leaving you hanging, because fuck you. That's why. Now I'm mad. Let's put a rose right here. You gotta at least do her birthday party before she When's her birthday party? When's her birthday? Peanut just wants you to beg? Yeah, she's one of those. She's a little extra. Nook, what's up, my guy? How you doing? Don't touch my bells. We need to get KK here stat. Why is that plot not built yet? Yo. You fuck. You're such an asshole. I'm doing this for you. Alright, alright, I'll put down the housing kit. Just get me the fuck out of your face. from please don't leave to fuck you really quick. Well, she's being a bitch! She's all, I, I think I want to leave. And I'm like, no, stay. And she's like, okay. <laughs> so that's why I'm like, no, fuck you. Oh, uh, this house is one block too far back. God, this sucks. This sucks. This whole layout sucks. Can I, hmm. Can I put you here? Ugh. I wanna put it right here. This isn't gonna work. Oh, it is, oh no. God. <sighs> Fucking sucks. Do I have room on this side? Peanut just needed to be reminded that she was loved. Sounds like you were neglecting her. I was fucking talking to her! Look at- look at- Alright, so she said how much she loved the Easter shit. So I put all- I wanted to make the Easter shit specifically to give it to her. And then it wouldn't let me give it to her. So I just put it all around her house. And that bitch doesn't even give a fuck that I did any of this shit, okay? He's like, I want to leave. I love Easter. You made all this Easter shit for me. You put it all around my house. I want to get the fuck out of here. And then she comes up to me and talks to me. Okay. So she's just being one of those, you know, she's being one of those. I got no room for another house. I don't want to build backwards. God damn it. I want I like this nice grid layout. Everything's nice. I'm going to have to put it randomly somewhere. And then I'm going to have to spend 50k just to move it when I terraform. 
damn it. Maybe I could put it here, like really close to this. That wouldn't, that should be fine. Is that going to be too far forward? Piss. Hello, AJ. I just got a tweet from you. Oh, here we fucking go. Oh, it's this. <laughs> Grandpa Wolf learns what a simp is. How long is that video? Four minutes? All right. I'm gonna slap a like on it. From the Wolfden account. <laughs> Grid layout, lol. What's so fucking funny? Okay. This might have to be just one block forward. Ruining everything. Just put, just put it here. I'm gonna have to move everything anyway. Oh wait, that's... That's perfect. That's perfect. Yay! Yay! I could have moved it left more. Fuck. Get Godzilla, man. All right. Now, I'm gonna buy a Nook Miles ticket. AJ, I got Flick, finally. The damn bastard. Hey, Bob, are you going to try Elder Scrolls Blades on Switch? No, I'm not. I feel like I'm the only one who likes it. Uh, Greg isn't is into that game. I don't I don't really care about those games. How much money did you make? A hundred K? Hundred thou? I didn't have many spiders because I sold a bunch of them because I had no money. <laughs> now we're going to go get some scorpions, though. Hello, Jeffrey. I should switch controllers. Get the macros going, you know? Oh, wait, is there still server maintenance? And a villager? I don't really give a fuck about the villager. I mean, if I see one, I'm gonna want them to come with me. Oh, you want to get in here, AJ? Yeah, I can get you in here.
there's someone. That is an ugly motherfucker. But I guess that's my new villager. Yes, hello. Hi. Hello. I have arrived. I'm here. Hello. We are playing Monopoly on Sunday. Yo, it's going to be lit. Just, you know, can't wait for that MDB commentary, you know? <laughs> <laughs> so, is there a way to immediately tell if this island is going to have bugs on it? Um, what do you mean? <laughs> like, can't you, like... You're talking about, like, will you be able to make it a, a scorpion island or whatever the fuck? Yeah. I don't think you can do that right now. Because I think that, well, I don't know. Because um, if the bugs that, like, spawn on the water, if they're in the season, I don't think that the uh, you can make it so that the only bugs that spawn are the scorpions. Oh, yeah, but that's fine. Because then, cause then you can just, you could just have to also get the water bugs. But... So there you can do like some islands just don't have bugs or they have the wrong types of bugs um then uh, no i don't think that there's a way to like immediately tell other than seeing a bug that it true. or a, a group of them true. true so like right now i don't see any fucking bugs so it's i'm getting scared that island has water bug. oh there's a water bug all right i think we're good then i think we're good is my freaking turbo turn on or what? Okay. I have turbo on. How does it feel to know that Crisis is coming to Switch and COD isn't? I actually didn't know that. I knew we were getting a remaster, but I didn't. No, it was coming to switch. Where? Why is my turbo? Are you gonna turbo or what? There we go. There we go. Now we're talking. Ugh. You know, I'm gonna start from the very beginning. I haven't played this game in days. And prior to that, I haven't played it in weeks. <laughs> I just want to unlock terraforming, and then I'm just and then gonna throw the game in the trash. <laughs> I'm at the point where, like, you know, like people will talk about how, like, they stop playing it for whatever reason, and then they don't want to play it because they stop playing it, so they like they, <laughs> they don't yeah. want to fucking villagers to shit on them and stuff like that. It's like I don't even want to deal with that. <laughs> That'll be me. I just, I already know I'm going to, I'm going to get fucking passive aggressively shit on by my villagers. <laughs> like, oh, you're still alive. Huh? I get that every time I play. <laughs> Even if it's like two days, they're all like, where the fuck have you been? <laughs> and I'm like, bro, give me a, I have a life, dude. Fucked up, man. I wanted to do so much, but then, like, as soon as I got terraforming, I was just overwhelmed. I was like, it's too much <laughs> shit that I need to do. <laughs> I fucking tear down everything and rearrange it. House is late. I'm, I'm happy about my house. <laughs> Am I going to have enough fruit to move all these trees? Oh no, I don't have um, to move the trees, I just leave the stumps. Nom Circle said, uh, chop down the trees and take out the stumps. Yeah. Oh, oh yes, 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 that's what I gotta do. I don't know what the yeah, fuck Yeah, because the right bugs now. are going, they still spawn on the stumps. What the fuck am I doing right now? Oh yeah, I could just chop them down. Uh, I want to do all the trees at once. but I need the fruit for the rocks. All right, I'm gonna do everything one at a time here. It's 
fucking too much for me. I'd never bothered to make a, a scorpion or tarantula island in this game. I, I made my fortune in turnips. <laughs> I don't even think you need... I'm only doing this because Flick's here. Uh, I don't even think you need to pick up the flowers. I'm just doing it anyway. Well, I should keep these flowers. I think no. bugs spawn on flowers, too. I think you're supposed to just take the tops off the flowers and leave Oh, them. yeah, 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 yeah. But I'm just taking them all anyway. You could just run on them. <laughs> Let me talk to this ugly-ass villager that I'm about to get. Yo, every time a villager comes into my campsite, it's always a fucking ugly villager, and then I immediately leave. <laughs> like, I go in there, I'm like, oh, shit, you're ugly, and I just fucking dip. I don't even talk to them. <laughs> I just, I want to take anybody I can get, because I just want a vill- I just want KK as fast as possible. See, I already got ten villagers, so I would have to kick somebody out. And there's one person I do want to kick out, but I want to swap them out for an amiibo, and I Th just don't feel like going through that process. <laughs> Thanks, by the way. What? For a fucking Bertha. Oh. <laughs> oh, shit. Uh, Bob, huh? Where, where are you from? Butt Island? Cool, cool. You here for some R&R, &R too? I don't like, I don't like you. Just, just come to my island. How, wait, how do I get them? You talk to them. Get away to my island. I'll have you around here. As the wrong opinion and said, Bertha is adorable. <laughs> That's just wrong. <laughs> I totally didn't expect to make any huge decisions on. Okay, dude, just come to my island. <laughs> Your villager looks perpetually shocked. Yeah, I put my eyebrows really high up. He's got a YouTube thumbnail face, you know? It's true. Yeah, it's too much energy. Uh, nice this, <laughs> this needs to go. I'm sorry, buddy. Oh, can I not take that down? You suck. Cat, you're ruining everything. Don't they always? Don't leave her behind. Did I do everything I needed to do? Pretty sure she's coming. What was it even the point of that? <laughs> what? How you just harvested the flower? I'm just taking all the flowers. I don't. I don't know why. I'm just. I'm just laying waste to the land here. That's like the one aspect of this game that I do not give a fuck about. Flower, every flower that's on my island is there because the game told me I needed to do it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm liking the little garden I have for the entrance. Um, yeah, otherwise I don't. I don't give a fuck about the flowers. I planted like roses around my museum, but then they got all fucking crazy, so I'm back to just not giving a fuck. Because <laughs> they like breed or bread. <laughs> Damn it. Damn it. Just Kate pick them up, Bob. Just... Oh. Bugs won't spawn and you'll s save shovel durability. Kate, it's too damn late, dude. I've done this before and bug spawned. Fine. There, I already, I already laid waste to the, to the land. Oh my god, I yeah, <laughs> man, all freaking turnips. What the hell is that? Oh, you have to plant them. You can't get rid of them. Oh, I'm so fucking stupid. Yeah. Yeah. Why didn't you say that, Kate? <laughs> I 
God damn it, now I have to replant all of these friggin' <laughs> flowers. Why don't you run over them while you're near them? Just shut the hell up. <laughs> <laughs> Let me play this my own way. Why don't you way, waste you know? your time in our time? Yeah. I'm a, listen, your time, there's no hope for it. You're here already, you know? That's true. That's true. You're all willingly allowing me to waste your time. That's a good point. That's a good point. Today, I sat and I watched almost all of Joe Rogan's podcast with Tony Hawk. Mm hmm Doing nothing else. How long else. is it? <laughs> it's like an oh hour my God. and 45 How minutes. How? I just watched it, do, and I did nothing but watch it. I focused only it is, on it. <laughs> it is impossible for me to do that. I know, but anything. I don't know what happened. I was just like, this is all I'm doing now. And then I fell asleep. <laughs> Fell asleep. That's why I say almost all of it because I fell asleep in my chair. Oh my god. Yeah, you're old. <laughs> the day I fucking fall asleep in a chair is the day I'm going to home. You've never fallen asleep in, in your chair? Life. No. Not even nope. while you're like working on stuff? Nope. That's nope. fucking bullshit. <laughs> you're being robbed of, a, of a, an experience. <laughs> <laughs> All right, that was very quick. I feel like so so uh Der, Der Maziel <laughs> said I was falling asleep in my chair in primary school. How can you not? I feel like that's different unless you didn't have desks. Like that's different cuz you have something to like lean on, you know? Mm -hmm. Like you're falling asleep in a chair, you're doing the whole like fucking grandpa like head back <laughs> mouth of gate. <laughs> Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna try attempt to make a macro here. Nom Circle said, "How do you watch a podcast? Aren't they audio only?" Not this is a video open. podcast. Also, Wolf Den Live is a video podcast. It's a big fan. Ah, fuck! I fucked up this macro. Ah, whatever. I'll do it on the next one. Geothermal said, I don't understand how people fall asleep in a chair. There is never a comfortable position. That's what I'm saying. Sometimes you just fucking fall asleep. I think you're all <laughs> liars. Everybody's saying they haven't fallen asleep in a chair. You're all fucking liars. I'm speaking facts. I've literally never felt it. Other than, like, yeah, at school or something, like, when a desk is in front of me. But I've never just, like, straight up fucking, like, leaned back and fell asleep in just, a chair. Just freaking, just like this. Nope. I mean, this chair does this, though. So, sure. now, I'm, now I'm just napping. <laughs> Good night. <laughs> no one oh. might have kicked in your back, sleep in your bed. <laughs> All right, let's attempt this again. Listen, whippersnappers, eventually your body gets so tired that it just says, we need sleep, so we're taking it. <laughs> yeah. That's what I'm talking about. Wait, Kate's older than me, too? <laughs> Do you not need fruit to pick up a stump? Okay, boomer. <laughs> The fruit snack when you eat them. What? What are you talking about? Okay. I think I made the macro. 
hit X at the end for some reason though. So that's just gonna I'm happen every time. I'm 26 in a couple weeks. I'm already 26, so you can't call me a whippersnapper. <laughs> Got sweaty hands, and I'm not even doing anything in this game. This is Jerry sleeping in his chair. Jerry just sleeps all day, every all the time. Jerry today was text. I'm in like a group chat with Jerry and Greg, mm -hmm. and every morning he goes, "Greg, hurry up, let's go," so they can stream together. Mm -hmm. Um, and today, let me read exactly what he said because it was. Very funny. Um, yeah, now everybody's telling their age <laughs> in the chat. Oh, uh, he's he, this was at one something, and Greg was like, Yeah, I overslept. And Jerry goes, Lucky, lucky you, I've been up since eight, I'm exhausted. <laughs> and I was like, All right, what have you been doing since eight? And he said, I had to get laundry, and then I laid in bed all morning watching videos and somehow, and some show about Nazis. How so he was exhausted he... watching shows about Nazis. That's <laughs> just, wild. just took it out of him. He, you know, he was so upset. Yes, dude. Yeah, he was thinking of the atrocities of the Nazis. Yeah. There's a lot of, uh,. Animosity in the group chat because uh because of the Chinese food thing. No, because I I was trying to find the voice clip of Jerry saying the thing about the Chinese food, and I can't find like what started me going. That's a little racist. <laughs> I think I said it. I think I said it was racist. I and did, but I was, like, and then you were like, "Yeah, that is racist." No, it was something in the way he said something in particular. I was like, "You can't uh, say that." Yeah, you know. <laughs> Yeah. And then he backed off of it, but I can't remember what it was that I was like, ah, it's a little dicey there. <laughs> but anyway, no, the animosity is that <clears throat> Greg doesn't call out enough in Call of Duty. Mm -hmm. And he blames it on the fact that Jerry doesn't shut the fuck up. He's always talking about random shit. But I'm like, you just got to talk over Jerry saying all of this shit, you know? Yeah, man. And and I have it set up in Discord now where there's different roles and mm -hmm. if you're some roles have the ability to talk over other people. So right. I can like if I demote you to a different role every time uh, you're talking I can just interrupt you and it'll mute you or it'll make right. you really quiet. Yeah. Uh, so I'm going to do that to Jerry so that Greg can call out. But then I was watching clips. I don't think it's going to work. I don't think it's going to work. I think well, Greg is just quiet. <laughs> yeah, that's the thing. Greg is just quiet and he doesn't want to talk. And I'm like, no, it's good that Jerry is like wacky because it's like funny and stuff. But Greg still need to call out. And I, like I was watching the video, like he sent the video of them playing today. And Greg's shooting a guy. There's two guys and he's not saying anything. He's just shooting. And Jerry's like, what's happening? What's happening? <laughs> But then you got Jerry on the other side going, uh, guy over there? <laughs> like, okay, where's there? Or I have a clip where I'm where he's like, guy over there? I'm like, where? And he's, he's like, he's over there. And I was like, is he on top of the building or is he on the bottom? Is he on the roof or is he on the bottom? He's like, I don't know. <laughs> I was like, then where did you see him? Because AJ did it. AJ did what? Oh, why are we revealing our ages? I, I only did it because uh, Kate over here called me a whippersnapper. <laughs> Which, like, usually fair. Usually I'm the youngest one in the whatever the fuck, the stream or whatever. The chats, the what have yous. <laughs> the what have yous. <laughs> I like those. Yeah, me too. There better be... Oh no! Oh no! I'm not good at this. 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 Oh, <laughs> what? Catching the, the wasps? Yeah. Oh, they got me! I wasn't even slowing down! Big ol' rip.
I guess that's just gonna be my face now. Damn, you got fucked up. Now you gotta go to one of your villagers and they're gonna be like, oh shit, and they're gonna give you medicine. <laughs> now Cat's gonna be like, I'm not coming with you, you look like shit. Oh, okay, I'll just sit. <laughs> Kate said, Greg just silently snipes while Jerry is talking about something that happened to him when he was 12. No, Greg doesn't snipe. Greg, Greg also isn't very aggressive, you know? What do you mean? Like in the game or as a yeah, person? Yeah, like I'll be like, uh... Uh, there's a guy upstairs I'm gonna ap approach, and Greg will, and Greg just won't say anything, and he'll just sit in the corner with the heartbeat sensor out, like, waiting for me to Yo, basically die, and then he'll come and run up. Save. Or he'll go around, mm. and it's like, well, I'm already shooting. We need the DPS. I need you to fucking shoot, you know? <laughs> Eric said, wizards are a peaceful people. <laughs> Uh, Saeed said, Opinion on Crisis, come into Switch. I think that's awesome. I'm going to play it. Well, are they doing the second one? Because I only I really want to play the second one. I think it's just the first one. It's Crisis Remastered, I think. Crisis is great. The first Crisis is great, but I like the second all one. All I know is the meme. It's literally all I know about that game. Is that the can it's computer It's like, run if, crisis? If, yeah, if you can run it, your console's like fucking, or your system, I guess. I need to plug in my computer. <laughs> oh god. I don't think I need to pick up the shells, right? I think I could just leave the shells. What? No, 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 no. You stupid. You stupid idiot, man. Okay, I'm back. <laughs> no, Crisis is great. I, I, the the problem with Crisis is that if you play it now, you're gonna go, oh, that's where all these games got those ideas from. <laughs> AJ was too young when the first Crisis launched. I, I existed and was fucking aware of life when that game came out. When did it come out? I'm gonna say 2006. Early 2000. You know if it was was it 2006? First release, Crisis, November 13th, 2007. That's later than I thought. Yeah, no, I played. I had it on my PC. I didn't even have a great PC. AJ, did you make sure to plug your computer into a license switch dock? <laughs> of course. The the first crisis is weird because like first you're fighting like mercenaries and stuff and then all of a sudden there's like fucking aliens and shit and like all these like things that look like the matrix uh like creatures it was weird it was a weird game it was cool uh i don't play shooters <laughs> so like i never play that game ever the only shooter that I used to play a lot is Gears. And that was because of Logan. Other than that, never had a reason to play shooters. Bob, show us your Steam library. No, because there's just all these games that I'm never gonna fucking play. And all these game, like all these games that I don't know where the codes came from. <laughs> You know, so it's not like I bought any of these games or have these codes for any particular reason. You redeem those? I have so many fucking Steam codes that like, I, and I'll just see, at this point, I see Steam in the subject line, I just delete the fucking No, games. I don't, I don't redeem all of them. I redeem uh, ones that I want. Mm -hmm. And like old ones, like back before YouTube, when I just got random codes for stupid reasons, I would redeem just because I was like, oh, free game. You know? Right. If only you knew. <laughs> <laughs> I 
I got a uh, Grand Theft Auto because it's free with the Epic uh, on the Epic Game Store. Um, mm -hmm. But I have no room for it on my computer. <laughs> so now I just have Grand Theft Auto and I can't play it. I have. That's, oh, that ended yesterday. I have Grand Theft Auto on. A PlayStation? I think it's on PlayStation. I have a, yeah, PlayStation, PlayStation 4. And that's it. But I don't play it. Alright, it's time. It is rock time. And you send me the codes. Ah, then I gotta sift through my email, and that sounds like a nightmare. God. Starting over. Turn around. Boop. Boop. Oh, that was quick. So like after you asked the uh, asked me <laughs> who my manager was, this man has the nerve, unrelated, to tweet. Uh, he put Pokin greater than Smash. And I'm like, what? <laughs> is, is that your manager? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh my god. I was like, oh, he's about to. I'm about to leave screen. <laughs> <laughs> I can't trust this man. <laughs> With managing my YouTube channel? Save is free, holy cow! All right, let's try this again. John, not me. I was trying oh, to... I don't have- I didn't freaking eat a fruit. I, I gotta eat a fruit. enthusiastic for him. Uh, I'm not gonna farm these... Uh... Rocks, there's no Why reason to do that. Ah, oh, goddammit. Because I have a YouTube channel. <laughs> Two. <laughs> Cat, get the flip out of my way. Uh, the Septagon said, AJ, whatever happened to that one guy who used to do vids on your channel? Can't remember his name, sadly. That. That's what happened. Yep. What happened? People didn't say his name in the mirror three times, so he vanished. <laughs> <laughs> Benji said, What do people think of pizza pockets or hot pockets? <laughs> <laughs> I'm I'm a fan of hot pockets. Only the pizza ones, really, and the the egg and Yo, cheese the, ones are good. I think they, like the fuck the ham ones are like the most popular ones or some shit. What the fuck is wrong with people, dude? The ham ones? Yeah. What is it? Ham and what? The ham and cheese. It's like ham and cheese. That's not that, that. The pizza ones are the best ones. I. That's what I'm saying. Fucking. I don't want nothing. I want no parts of fucking ham and cheese hot pockets. <laughs> Man, ham shit. and cheese sandwich is fine. Yeah, that's fine. But ham and cheese pot pockets are just fucking like nah. nah. Wait, why am I freaking putting? Why am I digging holes when I just have to hit the rock once? I'm stupid. I'm a big dumb dumb idiot face. All right, that's it. Where the island's clear. Now I gotta put all this shit on the beach. Cat, you're in my way. I'm starting to get worried that there's not gonna be any freaking. Uh, scorpions on the island. Saeed said, never had a hot pocket. Good, you take care of your body. <laughs> <laughs> Pizza rolls are way better. They're just small hot pockets. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I'm going to keep all this in my inventory. I'm not going to fucking even do nothing with them. All right, where are the, where are them water bugs at? There's one. 
That reminded me, I, fu I got fucking Chinese food, dude. Finally. Oh, shit. I'm fucking starving. I had a poke bowl before. It was Yo, delish. That's lit. What Pokemon came in? <laughs> uh, ocean trout. Salmon uh, and something Pokemon else. Shitty. <laughs> Didn't have many things. So Didn't you have many are playing items. yourselves. What are you talking about? Both pizza rolls and hot pockets up. Oh. I'm I'm a, I'm a fan story. of a good hot pocket. <laughs> Me. <laughs> I'm a fan of of the hot pocket. You know, in a pinch. Like, if it's between that and Taco Bell, I'm gonna pick a fucking hot pocket. <laughs> yeah, Probably. I mean, I mean, you know, I don't like Taco Bell, but yeah. so, for some reason, like once a month, I'm like, I need Taco Bell. <laughs> I, I know, know that it sucks, but for some reason, the, I'm the like, only I need time this. I'll ever get hot, uh, like Taco Bell like by choice is when like fucking after streaming and it's literally the only thing that's open yeah. and will deliver to me <laughs> and then i'm like i but i guess <laughs> see the the one that i that was closest to me when I <laughs> eric said hot pockets over taco bell bam <laughs> <laughs> the the one that was uh closest to my parents house used to be a taco bell pizza hut and I used to get a fucking whole pizza and the cheesy gordita crunch. And that was my meal. And then a Baja Blast. Fucking, then they got rid of the pizza hut. And then, and then I just ended it all. <laughs> <laughs> all that's on here are water bugs. I'm starting to get mad. I feel like liking going to pizza hut is blasphemous for you. You shouldn't be allowed to do that. Cause I like even being from New Jersey, I feel like it's kind of blasphemous. Wait, what? Like people get mad about liking chain pizza, like fucking Grimhain. You ever see Grimhain? Oh, Whenever listen. Bring up. It's the same. Listen. Sometimes you just want a cheeseburger. <laughs> sometimes you want a good cheeseburger, you know. And sometimes you just want shitty McDonald's. I don't know if that if that's the same, because like that's you can same. get. No, it's, it's just not. You're adding a different food. Because like, because like, for cheeseburgers, you're not gonna like. You can get good pizza for cheap, in New York. But you can't uh -huh. get good burgers for cheap. So like, you settling yes. for a shitty burger, but you can't could get also be like a thing of like I don't want to spend on Long Island. You can't get burger. that pizza after like nine o'clock. What, like, oh yeah, that's true, that's true. Trust me, I'd much Good rather point. have like an actual pizza than fucking Pizza Hut. Yeah, makes sense. Also, you know what, here in Brooklyn, after a certain time, the pizza starts to, the pizza options dwindle exponentially. It's fucked. You got robbed. <laughs> Apparently, if you just hold down ZR, uh, it crafts quicker. You don't have to like mash. Nope, I lied. That's that's wrong. <laughs> I'm holding down ZR and A, and it's mash. It's like uh, mashing the craft. And I don't think I have turbo on. All right, where are uh, these? I'm just getting water Dace bugs. Cole, Dace Cole <laughs> said Pizza Hut sucks. Domino's is pretty damn good. I fucking disagree. <laughs> I think they're both the same. I don't know. We I always order Hut, this place called... I think called, Pizza Hut is like marginally better. <laughs> we always order this place called Archie's. Uh -huh. And it has a hint of Pizza Hut to it. <laughs> But it's just the it's like the go-to pizza that we get and it's not even cheap What's wrong with you? I don't know The toppings are fantastic though. I get I get fucking chicken Pepperoni and uh, Aru Arugula uh -huh. Some sort of green thing <laughs> 
It's fucking amazing. It's I'm pretty cool. sure arugula is green. <laughs> In fact, I'm gonna I have some leftover. I'm gonna eat that right after this. Yo, I still got Chinese food. It's gonna be late. It might just be no. It's not spinach. Yo. Spinach Why are there only food. water bugs? Pretty dope though. Cause I'm, game sucks, dude. I'm getting mad. <laughs> when I did the Spider Island, there were water bugs and, you know. The other ones. <laughs> Spiders. Jesus. That was racist. <laughs> Those dirty other ones. <laughs> the pepper is the best part. Square pizza fills the hole. Uh, Archie's is square pizza. Well, no, it's a round pizza that they cut in squares. Wrap your head around that. That's stupid. You need to never go to that place again. One time I ordered it and they cut it like a normal pizza and I got disappointed. <laughs> I was like, what happened? What do they do? It is, so it is annoying because that means the middle has no crust. So you can't uh -huh. really hold it well. And then like the edges aren't squares. No. So you end up with like some little like, tiny pieces of pizza with all crust. That's like that's like just so they can be like, we give you fucking fourteen or the twenty three slices of pizza. Yeah, they give you a lot of slices, but they're really tiny slices. That's why it's kind of like Pizza Hut. <laughs> <laughs> but their pizza, when they cut it in squares, it's like I mean, it's like it's like an oval. They're like fucking like you know with the square slices. It's not a circle. It's like an oval. It Did like you... wants to be a rectangle, but it's not. It's a polygon. Did you see the uh, Good Mythical Morning with Gus Johnson, where they yeah, challenged... where they ordered from fucking what was it? Well, it was all different uh, chains. Wasn't it? I think it was Pizza Hut, Domino's, and Papa John's. Yeah, and they gave them all different like ridiculous instructions, and they all pulled through. <laughs> yeah, man. There, there was like a while ago, like when I still lived in Florida, so like 2016, 2017. Um, God damn it! Fucking uh, somebody made a video about like buying food from. Ch I mean, they made a good mythical morning that was similar, but they didn't like do the same thing. They they went to different like fast food chains and were like, "Yo, uh, make me this," and they brought in their advertisement. It was like, "Make it look like that." <laughs> oh yeah. And then they would like fucking make it, and then he'd be like, ah, it doesn't look like that. And then they would make it again. I'm like, what the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> I think they have to. I was like, I feel, no, I feel like if I did that in the, anywhere in the Northeast, they would try to fight me. <laughs> <laughs> you, I think there's a 50 50 chance that they would either make it again or try to fight you. <laughs> <laughs> You hear this bullshit about mustard on hamburgers? You got is that in Pennsylvania? What's the deal? Um, so I hear that people like that's just normal in like a lot of different places. Like, but I know the only place that does it here in fucking Pennsylvania um, is McDonald's does it, and they don't even do it on all their burgers. They do it on their double cheeseburgers. That's it. Yeah. That's weird. You're in like a it weird. weird. Middle it's ground. Weird. It is weird. You get like, I heard in some states, like even fucking Burger King does it. And Burger King, I don't even think Burger King has mustard here. <laughs> where mustard. was I? Oh, I was in Boston. That's where, that's where it happened. And I was appalled. I was outraged. <laughs> I guess I'm freaking water bug hunting. God damn it. I'm confused. What about mustard? That they put mustard on their burgers, dude. Yeah, apparently everywhere puts water on their burgers, except what? New York. <laughs> you, said, you said water. I said water on their burgers? You said everyone puts water on their burgers. Everyone puts water on their burgers. I mean, in a roundabout way, I guess. Everybody puts mustard. Every state puts mustard on their burger, except in downstate New York. I think upstate doesn't do it either. Um, wait, AJ, you're from Pennsylvania, too. Do you know about tomato pie? LOL, it's so bomb. I'm, I live here. <laughs> <laughs>
Um, but is that but also what is that? no? I don't know what that is. They informed me. The only like weird Pennsylvania thing that I know of what it is, and I've never tried it, and I refuse to try it, is Scrapple. What is that? It's like fucking like pig remains in like a loaf. In a loaf? Yeah, uh, it's right, like this is, this is getting it's like up pig right loaf. <laughs> Scrapple? Yeah. Oh, there it is. It's like a meatloaf, but a pig. Yeah. All right. Oh my god, it looks like bread. Yeah. It's fucking. It, well, I don't know if it that looks is, fine. But, I would eat that. But I'm not. No, nah, I'm not down. If I didn't know what it was, I, I'd probably like unwittingly try it and be like, "This is fine." But like, nah, I know what it is. I'm not fucking with it. It's like spam. Nah, Except man, that looks I don't, bad. I don't eat that shit either. <laughs> Look, man, I'll eat a hot pocket, but I ain't eating no spam. <laughs> <laughs> if you're eating a ham hot pocket, guess what? <laughs> The hot pocket, you can have that on your box. There's a free box quote. Also, I'm not eating a ham hot pocket. Hot pocket either. Fuck that too. Ham hot pocket. Gross. Gross. Flick better love Stand these water really bugs. Popular in Hawaii. Yeah, I know. Hawaii is strange, dude. It's popular in Japan too. But I, I mean, that makes sense. Proximity, dude. They probably um, brought it over. It's <laughs> true. <laughs> but, um, I remember when I went to Hawaii when I was like 10, I just thought it was like the fucking going to be like all beach. And I saw like there was like cities and shit. I was like, yo, what the fuck is this, man? <laughs> <laughs> I felt ripped off. This is I don't exotic. even like the beach. The beach is too much sand. Too much. Too much sand, dude. It's coarse and gets everywhere. Yeah. <laughs> You ever had a Welsh cake? Um, I don't think so. Is I gonna Google what a Welsh cake is? Oh, I gotta do it. Is a Welsh cake just the butt of a corgi? Oh my god. What is this? It's got SCT. Like, looks like it has blueberry. Traditional in it. Welsh cake. See, this is a thing. See, this is a thing. This is like up there in like the UK and shit. And they're weird, dude. So, like, I don't even, like, there's probably, like, blood in that or something. I'm not down. <laughs> yeah, well, is that chocolate or is that blueberry? That's always the, the, it's always the scary. No, it's like, it's like, is that chocolate or is that a lamb's eye? <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry, UK. Don't get mad at me. That's an English muffin. What is it? I'll keep saying ham hot pocket and now I'm concerned this is an <laughs> urban dictionary thing. No, what, it's a ham and cheese hot pocket. What is a currant? A what? Corinth raisins. Ew, those are raisins. Get the fuck out of my face. <laughs> Yo, raisins with that. are fucking garbage. Get out of here. I, I, was, kept them grapes. I was watching James May, one of the Top Gear guys. He went to Japan. I didn't understand anything that you just said. What is that? You know the show Top Gear? No. The British show about cars, okay. but they... It, it, you don't watch it for the cars. You watch it because the three old guys that do it are fucking hysterical. Gotcha. Um, and one of the guys, his name is James May, and he went to Japan. And he was just, like, basically fighting with one of the uh, machines that you use to, like, take your order. Mm -hmm. Um... And he was talking about how uh, he got his food and he was like, uh, uh, they're all about their seafood, but uh, uh, it's also really comforting to have a nice bowl of ramen. Now, it ain't no blood sausage or whatever he said. And I was like, all right, dude, you're too fucking British. <laughs> Nobody has ever uttered those words. <laughs> I couldn't survive there, man. And they eat beans for breakfast. I'm not down with oh, that. That's what he said. Sausage and it ain't no sausage and beans. Yeah, no, like, fuck dude. that, man. I don't even eat beans at all. I think I'm Gavin like, said he was like talking about uh, having a nice traditional English breakfast. Yeah, they breakfast. did it. They like made it for him. That's... And he said it was like cold. <laughs> I was like, ew. That's even worse. Fucking cold beans. All right. Beans are bad enough on their own. But cold beans? What beats a nice American breakfast with all the shit, you know? 
the pancake. Oh, I'm sorry, waffles. The yeah, waffles. How dare. See, exposed. The <laughs> eggs, the ham, the bacon, the hash browns. What country beats that out? Their breakfast? Mexican um, breakfast is Corey Guns. What? I see, that's I, the thing. I feel like I they feel don't like eat breakfast tacos. <laughs> I feel like you're thinking breakfast tacos, and that's not what they eat. That's what I think. I'm gonna Google Mexican breakfast. I, um, see, that's the thing. Like, I only know, um, like the fucking British breakfast and American breakfast. All right, this looks pretty good. Mexican breakfast looks. Uh, there's no way that they do this. <laughs> there's no way I'm going to Tijuana, going to get breakfast, and I'm gonna get one of these things. There's no way. Oh, Mexico. Uh, in Mexico, they eat beans for breakfast, so they're out. They're out. Get out. They're out. Get yeah, out. Get the fuck out of here. All right, I filled up on water bugs. This is everything I ever wanted to do. Great. Awesome. Sick. Venezuelan breakfast. Get me out of here. Do I have to do anything with Cat? Is she coming? <laughs> now I'm circle said what? About what? I don't, I don't I have no context. I think they're all mad at me for, for saying Mexico definitely doesn't have uh, breakfast tacos for breakfast. <laughs> <laughs> Mighty Ike said, I'll show you, Bob, you dildo. Um, uh, I feel like, what does Australia have for breakfast? Fucking yeah, what do they have, have? Slice of toast? Italy <laughs> has breakfast lasagna. Yo. I just made that up. That's crazy. <laughs> Australian breakfast. I thought you were looking up breakfast lasagna. <laughs> no. All these pictures look great, but I know that this is not what it looks like if you go to fucking Australia and get breakfast. Ask Wood. Says Benji. Is that is that Lox? Ugh. I don't know why I don't like Lox, but I like sushi. What's the difference? Um, marketing. <laughs> Sushi's cooler, dude. <laughs> <laughs> I guess I just don't trust the Jews to prepare my fish. <laughs> you took it there. That wasn't me. <laughs> what is, why is this person talking about Wilbur? Can you, you can bug Wilbur to bail you. What are you talking? Oh, that's... Do I need you to do anything? Okay, you're done. We're done here, so, cat. Vodka with cereal. What the fuck? Just get me out of here. I'm ready to go home. I failed miserably on my mission. Dude. Vegemite is good. Everybody in here needs to get banned. Is Vegemite and taste. Marmite the same thing, but Marmite has meat in it? Is he yeah, has Vegemite like the vegan version? Yeah, that's what I'm asking. Dairy and fruit. What about it? Egg, toast, bacon, Brazilian. tomato as traditional like cafe breakfast. That's American breakfast without the pancakes. Get the fuck out of here. No, I'm down. Fuck pancakes. Flick. Where are you? If Flick's not here anymore, I'm gonna be so flicking mad. <laughs> no, I don't think he leaves until like 4 a.m. Flick. Oh, Flick. Said said, uh, is the sa Said? I don't know how to say. Tell me how to say your name. P Said, said. like West Said. <laughs> Said. <laughs> that was uh, double racist, I think. That's not uh, racist. <laughs> Said it's the same but different names about Marmite and Vegemite. It's, it's like a brand thing. What? Canadian oh, the brands Vegemite and Marmite. Double, double. Farmers wrap. And a, I have a feeling that's a um, French thing. So I'm not even going to try to say that. Oh, Flick! Where the Flick are you? Mighty Egg said, Vegemite is amazing if you use it lightly and not from a spoon. Hello, Flick. If you fucking barely eat it, Vegemite is great. <laughs> <laughs> I've got bugs to sell you, buddy. Here you go. Beep, boop, bop, beep, boop, bop, 
Take all my bugs. Just call me Seed for now. Okay. Seventy-two thou. All right, I'm good. I'm gonna invest all these in turnips if I remember. Yo, that's how you get rich. So, do I need to do anything right now to get Cat on my island? No. She just, just gonna come? You just fucking nook calls her up and rakes her over the coals. So what about this? Is this gonna say Cat's place? Can you fucking? Rosa yeah, Sandra she's coming. Said, I used Marmite to make stews. How many villages do I? Have? I got one. A tahu. Three. Four. Ca cow. What the f five. Right. Oh, a bell tree. Let's do it. Let's do it. Give me my bells, bitch. I'm rich as shit. So I got five on this side. Oh, uh, that's not a house. I don't count. It's stew. Six. Seven. Beef, brisket, potatoes, rutabaga, eight. leeks, bacon fat. Nine. God damn it, I need one more. Bob, uh, what the fuck is beef shank? <laughs> beef shank? <laughs> yeah. That's uh, when you're in prison. <laughs> and you make a knife out of beef. Oh, I thought you were going in the other direction. I thought you were going to be like, that's when you're in prison and like one inmate doesn't like the other inmate and like their, you know, their crew has beef so they stab each other. <laughs> that's what I thought you were going to go. No, no, no. It's when you take a, it's when you take a piece of meat and you fashion it into a shank. <laughs> um, what did I even just pick up? No, beef shank is just a piece of meat. It's just a cut of meat. Oh, okay. That's just a pile of leaves. Get out of my face. <laughs> Mighty Egg said, remember, Bob said he'd be good in prison. Did you say that? What did I say? Oh, I'd be good in prison. Yeah, I did say that. I said <laughs> I think I would, I would be that? pretty good in prison. <laughs> I think what I'd make that, a lot of friends. What does that mean? <laughs> I think I would make a lot of friends. Mm -hmm. uh, and I think that uh, I wouldn't get beat up. <laughs> uh, let's talk it first. Where am I going to put this other person? I got no room, dude. Jesus. Ghetto Oyster said Bob would be the best prison wife. <laughs> I ain't no one's bitch, okay? <laughs> all right, all right. You're not just going to sit here and live, lie on fucking live twitch.tv slash wolfden. The reason it got brought up in the first place was because uh, Rikers Island mm -hmm. bought like an insane amount of these like really cheap emulators for like portable emulators for the inmates because they were weren't allowed to like go out or do anything during the whole pandemic so they gave them all these portable emulators with all these games loaded up on them you know illegal Yo, games. that's a trap that's a trap <laughs> what do you mean they're trying they're trying to prolong their sentence yeah they're trying to they're get like, oh, them you play you play to illegal games 20 more years I don't know if I want. Uh, try to read Welsh sentences. I don't want to. Trap two, you're just trying to laugh at me in my ignorance. This needs to be back one more. Go this way and this way. Ah, God fucking piss. I'm gonna spend so much money just moving houses. Big rip, dude. That's a uh, yeah, no, that's a good spot. That's fine. Yay! Swab, swab, a. Because now Jake I have saw a scorpion behind that house. So go behind that house. There's a scorpion. Thanks, Jerry. 
Apparently, behind that house. This house? I don't know. He just said that You're house. You're a flipping liar. You just fucking getting bald. Which house? <laughs> I need I need specifics. You're you're just making me run around. You don't even you you're just being a bitch. You don't even know. You don't even know, man. I don't even have any medicine. <laughs> How would medicine There is no medicine for scorpions. They just fucking yeet you. No, no, no. I'm, I I got stung by a bee before. Oh, uh, well, fucking talk to a villager. They'll probably give you medicine. Our peanut. Make it if you didn't already learn. Oh, peanut. Wow, is that movie makeup? You look like a monster. It's so cool. What? You were stung by a wasp. Oh my gosh, poor thing. I'm so sorry to call you a monster. Oh, Peanut. I knew it was good keeping you around. Wait, you didn't actually give me any medicine. Rib, dude. <laughs> what a fucking asshole. I'm starting to not like Peanut. <laughs> Alright, I'm done. I have nothing else to do here. Rib, dude. We stand the squirrel. You like my Godzilla? Sure. Oh, I need a thumbnail. It'd be a lot cooler if it was a robot, but... I know it would be. Oh, I don't want to take a thumbnail with a friggin' eye like this. <laughs> Alright, don't I have... Do you have any, uh, freaking? I think I have a recipe. Nest? I could probably scrounge one up. You just get stung again. <laughs> Did you pick up the one from the wasp? That's no, but I think I might have one in storage for a rainy day. You know. <laughs> is it not in any of these? Oh, here it is. Uh, That's inappropriate. Pumps uh, of weeds. Ryusuka said Ryo Ryosuka. I don't know, man. Said your Godzilla is so big, Bob Wink. Talk about my cock. <laughs> Willing to donate to the Make Bob's Island Not Shitty Fund too. Yo, I donated to that fund. I paid off a couple of public work projects or whatever the fuck. <laughs> what up, AJ? What up, Trev? I guess it would be under miscellaneous. AJ is the OG sugar mama. <laughs> Yo, it's true. I got nothing. Damn, son. Got. You got jammed. Damn it. Go oh, I gotta pick up my bells. Gotta have go a bell more, more of your villagers. Find one that cares about your well being. <laughs> Who do you think? I think Celia actually gives a fuck about me. Where is she? <laughs> Help! You know what? Fuck it. I don't even care. Oh, I want to name this. I finally found Flick. Oh, the video. You yeah, also, so you got to go find Flick. <laughs> yeah. You know what? I should fix my eyeball. Cherry, you care about me, right? Your face. Oh, Cherry. You know, you were my previous favorite. You were my previous favorite Islander. Now you are my favorite. Fuck See, peanut. now don't you feel like a piece of shit for replacing her in your heart? She's got the biggest property. So fuck her. Where is this guy? <laughs> oh, Flick. There you That's are. Toxic. Flick, can you fucking come somewhere that is cool? Like over here by the Godzilla? That'd be sick, you Flick. You her the biggest property just so you can uh, fucking hold it over her head. Flick. 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 Flick, no. Flick, no. Flick, go by Godzilla. I need a thumbnail. Flick, no. Flick, please. Please, Flick. <laughs> He's like, I didn't fucking sign a release form, you piece of shit. He's like, please stop touching me. They don't get mad. Like, the visiting people 
the flicks, the fucking rat. Well, the rabbit, he got mad. But for a different reason. Regular ass villagers, they're like, yo, stop fucking pushing me, you piece of shit. Where's the camera? Oh no! Put that back! Great. You got you gotta take out your net too. I forgot how to fucking do the camera app. Yo, I want his net. His net is sick. I think you could buy a no. Nah. You could buy a net that does look different though, but I don't think it's that one. Why am I having a fucking stroke right now? It is the tradition. Stop fucking walking away! Blizzard next to Blizzard. Yo, it's SBO. Flick, dude. Flick don't give a fuck. Flick, you cooperate, please. How do these people make, like, videos with their villagers and shit? Um, Harvey's Island. Oh. God! Why do I keep <laughs> doing that? Ah! Your, your eyes were closed. Your eye. Your fucking sideways ass eye. You keep blinking, Flick! Flick! Every one of these pictures, his eyes are closed. <laughs> God, Flick. Okay, Flick. Please. I hope he just walks away. <laughs> he is. He's freaking walking away. God. I want that angle. And you didn't even do a reaction. I'm just doing what I can, man. <laughs> this fucking guy, dude. <laughs> Flick, I'm so happy you're here, Maybe but I also want to kill you. you oh, man, I like it with you on the own. light. He's probably scared. He's like, why is this man, this grown man, <laughs> playing Animal Crossing? <laughs> <laughs> Can I whistle or something? Yes, I think. What is the button? Oh, oh, he's looking. Oh, this is perfect. Dig holes. <laughs> perfect, perfect. We're done. We're done here. We did it. We did what we needed to. Is this fountain in the right spot? No! <laughs> Just fucking use your superhuman strength. Yeah. To reforge the earth underneath it. You're a uh, uh, earthbender. No, oh, shit. Sure. On Netflix. I don't know. If, uh, no, this has to be up here. Okay, that's it. There it is. Who are we raiding? Who's on? Um, let's see. <laughs> no. <laughs> uh, sea monsters online. I just raided her. Oh well. Scootish is on. Just chatting. Oh god. Uh. Oh, Head Burglar is playing Valiant. I haven't raided him in a while. There it is. Frosty's also online, but he's playing a less relevant game. Yeah, all these people are playing random ass games. Game Attack is playing Goldeneye. <laughs> BTS Smash playing Smash. <laughs> what a mix up, dude. Do you know uh, Sensei CJ? He's playing Mugen. What the fuck? <laughs> Mugen, I think, is that. Isn't that like a, like a fucking like, moddable fighting game or something? Yeah, like that? that's one of those like uh, fighting games that has like literally every character in it. Mm -hmm. Very. Uh, it's very copyright strikey. <laughs> Yeah, it's like one of those, it's like open source type shit. Yeah. 
All right, you're going ahead, burglar. Everybody just say hi. You know the drill. Just say hi. Say hi. You know the drill. And uh, I don't give a fuck what you do after that, but he's wearing a bow tie. Bye. Everybody go say hi. H -I make sure, chat. Make sure you eat your vegetables you and walk your cat. Walk your cat, pet a baby, hold a dog. <laughs> You know? Yep. The usual, you know? Now, I'll see you Saturday. Or maybe tomorrow. Who knows? Uh, if I'm bored. Wait, what's Saturday? I think I'm probably going to stream Call of Duty on Saturday. Oh, shit. Bye.